Hi guys, so um, today's video is going to be on uh, another character. Um, this video is really unscripted because I don't have much to say about him. So I really only did this because um, I've got an, a wheel of names with all of my character names on there and it landed on him and his character. There's like information in my head but not in words, right? So. This is my character, his name's Jamie, he's a fucked up green guy, and that's fine. So, what can I tell you about him? Um, he is, he's green, and he looks like this because he's like a zombie. He's reanimated, he's a corpse that got taken in by other forms of life, which you will see more than once in this series if I ever find finish it you will see it more than once <laughs> but yeah forgive me i'm a little bit cold with the, with the fuck i'm a little bit sick with the cold still um anyways he used to look like this this is why you're supposed to draw your ocs regularly guys or else they go out of design quick anyway that was his first design and that drawing was made um four years ago so it's not accurate at all and he is in a quartet of four strangely colored beings i made to try and branch out from just making pale humans i decided well instead of making black people i'll make them green <laughs> I had a very interesting mindset, but that's probably, that's not how I thought, but you know, it's a little bit strange that I resorted to literal aliens before my, like, darker skin, you know, internalized colorism, am I right? Anyway, I'll get to the rest of the quartet in some other videos, so I'm just going to talk about Jamie first. Um, firstly, he was created, um, to be friends with the yellow guy, um, but I quickly changed that and made it so that he was some kind of hallucination for the yellow guy. And I'll get into him because he's got a lot of information. I can talk about him for ages. And the thing is, um, because he's like green and like a zombie, I don't know if he's real or not. Like, I don't know if I want to choose to make him something that can exist or should I just leave him as a hallucination i'm not sure but we'll see where it goes and the story was that basically um the yellow guy his name is colin he found jamie um as a reanimated corpse after being friends with him in childhood or some years ago um if you couldn't tell by the hospital gown in the last picture, Colin is not well. He's a little bit cuckoo in the head, so it makes sense he'd imagine that shit up. So, yeah, that was the, that was the original story. I'm thinking I'm just gonna rewrite it, but I don't know what to do with him. And you know, knowing my um, intense attachment to designs, I'm not gonna sell him. So I'm just gonna, you know, he's a fucked up green guy. I might make him subject to one of my. Um, corporations, the, I forgot what it's called, I think it's Plantation Corporation, but basically they do human experiments, and that's fun, so, yeah, um, there are other OCs who fall into that group, and maybe, maybe I'll make a video on them, if need be. So, yeah, um, I don't really know what else to say about Jamie because, as I said, there's info in the brain, not on the Toy House page. So, yeah, he's just a fucked up green guy and that's just fine. He's just a little guy with a weird eyeball. I did decide to keep some of the original factors such as the missing eye, but I made it, like, you know people should do that more people should make like fucked up green things like that'd be so much fun anyway i guess i'll see you in the next one hopefully when i'm not so sick and nasally because i sound awful anyways see you in the next one